was the seventh player taken in this year's draft. Warmoth takes a fastball, high ball one. Tyler. 1 0 pitch, and Warmoth pulls it foul on a hop over off the netting in front of the Vancouver Duck. Bases loaded two down, the 1 1 pitch. That's a slider outside. 2 and 1 to Logan Warmoth. Apologies to Paul Harvey, is that the hops came back to win 9 8. Cutter foul back to, to setting up right over the middle. And the pitch, curveball, a swing, and a fly ball towards center field. Going back is Perez. He's got a play. He's got the ball, and the side is retired. Against Hillsboro. There's a ground ball pulled foul. 0 and 1 the count. There's a ground ball toward third, charged by Ellis. He reaches out, tries to apply the tag, missed the runner initially, but then applies it on Clemens at second effort. Clemens doing a good job to avoid the tag long enough to one of the outfielders between innings. Warmoth has flied to center, grounded out to third. On base, four on second or third. 1-0 pitch. There's a line drive, yanked into left, a base hit for Warmoth. That's just his third hit in 14 at-bats against Hillsboro. Badamo left one up, and Warmoth yanked it into left. Lead off man aboard. Brock Lundquist coming up. They're moving around out in the hops pen. The pitch, breaking ball, drops in there for a strike on one. Gave up a hit, had one strikeout. Oh, one pitch, breaking ball to swing and a fly ball toward right down the line. Long run for a rise. He's not going to get there. The ball drops. One run scores. To third base is Adams being waved home. Here he comes. The throw to the plate. Barsho will not get him. The game is tied at three on a double by Logan Warmoth. Warmoth collects his eighth and ninth runs batted in. And close the book on Kevin Ginkle. One inning plus three hits, two runs.